So it's like somehow like a David Lynch movie uh, where you know the reality is always twisted and the language of film narrative on a David Lynch movie is somehow changing. And I try to do the same, but on a game level. Talking about David Lynch, I have to say that uh, most of the characters of the game are inspired by real persons, uh, like musicians, uh, film directors, writers. And this is also to uh, describe how the protagonist itself might have surrounded himself with uh, fiction characters that exist only in his head. And so in his head he created those uh, people who are somehow references to what he likes in his life, you know, from music, films, books, and so on. So they are, you know, not really explicit references of those famous persons, but you can somehow recognize them also because in a way they speak like them, or they quote something similar to them. And all of this helps to create this uh, alterate state of mind that the protagonist is living throughout the game. So the world itself, uh, where the game is set, and all its characters can be somehow just in the head of the protagonist. Even though the 10 endings, the 10 different narratives, explain in different ways what's actually happening. I also wanted the game to raise a lot of uh, philosophical questions somehow about who we really are, in a way, what's the meaning of our life, uh, what's the purpose, what do we live for? So the protagonist is somehow asking uh, himself all those questions and also the other characters that he's meeting are uh, answering in their way to those questions. The way that the world constantly changes uh, makes you think what is really going on in the game, but also in our lives. In fact, there are many uh, philosophical aspects, you know, from the artificial intelligence to the death itself, to murder and uh, uh, criminal activities. I mean, there are a lot of different narratives that at the same time coexist. So you can choose a different path and find a different ending, but each ending is true which makes it like life itself. The game is like a matrioska dolls of layers and levels, which is like meta game, but at the same time makes you think, what if I'm me, myself, just the main character of someone else video game?